Hey, 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 it's Vader Day 8. Hey guys, Case here. How's it going? Hope you haven't missed me too much. I'm getting all these videos sorted out real quick. Do some editing, get it all working and everything. It's going to be awesome. For We Blog, We Vlog, Veda Day 8, we are talking about a second home. Where in the world would it be? And why do you want to live there? I have had good experiences in many places around the world and some bad ones. If I were to choose a second home in the world, I can tell you it wouldn't be in Compton, LA, for instance, where I was stuck there for 15 minutes at 2 in the morning once in 2006, and it was probably the scariest 15 minutes I ever had in my life. I uh, wouldn't live in Paris. Uh, it's nice enough, but I feel that is an air of snobbiness that didn't really vibe with me on my two trips there. I uh, would... <laughs> I, I Maybe I'd live in Amsterdam, but I have to be honest, I don't remember much of my trip to Amsterdam. That's another story for another time. Uh... I really like New York, but New York is damn expensive, so I don't know if I could live in New York without earning five times what I earn right now because I'd want to have the same kind of lifestyle and that just seems to be hard. Where I think I would live if I were to get a second home is Barcelona, Spain. Went there in 2005, loved it. Uh, probably a little different then, I mean I would have been 22 partying up till 6 in the morning. I was at a hostel, uh, I think it was called the Beach Point Hostel, and uh, I would lie around, I lied around on the beach all day because I was just, I had no energy left to do anything else, among other reasons. And it was just, it was a great time in general, like, despite the fact I almost got arrested. Also, another story for another time. <laughs> But I like the vibe in Barcelona, and I think that's a good place for me to be if I were to uh, find a place to rest my weary bones. Yeah, but I love Toronto. Toronto has been my home pretty much all my life. I grew up next door to Toronto uh, for my home, but I spent a lot of my time from 12 onward in Toronto proper itself. So I, every time I go somewhere, I miss things about Toronto and I love coming back to them when I'm back in town so I think I'm never moving away from Toronto we'll see I don't I don't see a reason for me to move anywhere else but time will tell for now that's the dream second home let's go with Barcelona that's a good answer where would you live if you had a second home anywhere in the world that's what I want to know that's what everyone wants to know you leave it in the comments below because that's how we work all right guys have a good one and I will see you on Veda video numero nuevo that is the extent of my Spanish, counting from 1 to 10. And see si and no. All right. Later, guys. Have a good one. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.